US National Guard soldiers are deploying to the border with Mexico. It is part of President Trump's attempts to clamp down on illegal immigration as his proposal to build a wall, a border wall, is held up. The flow of people, though, continues, as Rodri Davis reports. Taking off to come down hard at the US border. President Trump is mobilizing state National Guard troops to the country's southern frontier with Mexico. Texas is first. This deployment has begun with the movement of equipment and troops today. Within 72 hours, the Texas Military Department will have 250 personnel, along with ground surveillance vehicles, as well as light and medium aviation platforms. Others are coming. Arizona will deploy 150 members of the reserve military force. And the president wants up to 4,000 there in total. It's to stop people like these, those crossing illegally into the U.S. and is part of Mr. Trump's proposed tougher anti-immigrant policies. Also, on Friday, he said he'd end so-called catch and release. That's the freeing of detained illegal immigrants while they wait to hear if they'll be deported. Instead, President Trump wants to keep them in detention. We don't have laws. We have catch and release. You catch and then you immediately release, and people come back years later for a court case, except they virtually never come back. So uh, we are preparing for the military to secure our border between Mexico and the United States. Such arrests on the border are at a four-decade low. But pushed by poverty and violence in Central America and Mexico, hundreds of thousands of migrants every year are still willing to make the sometimes deadly journey to cross into the U.S. for a better life. The truth is my plan is to work for a long time along the border. That's what I'm going to do. Afterwards, God will say if I cross the border to the north, even though Trump doesn't want me to, but it has to be done. And it's further straining the relationship between the U.S. and Mexico, over whose border tens of thousands of people cross legally for work and trade every day. Mexico's president this week called disrespectful Mr. Trump's demand on Mexico to stop the flow of people, or the country's trade pact would be at risk. Sending National Guards to secure the border has been done before by both Presidents Obama and George W. Bush. For President Trump, it's just a stopgap until he gets funding for his campaign promise of a border wall, something the U.S. Congress is still to approve. Rodri Davis, BBC News.